Hello everyone, welcome to Aptitude Jab. This is a set which is a grid based puzzle. It says that there are four families Sharmas, Khannas, Reddies, and Patels. They are disguised by four different letters A, B, C, D. And uh, it is given that all of them have two children, and two of these families have a boy and a girl, and one family has two girls, and Patels have two boys. And some more information is given to us. Based on it, we have to map the family, the code, and we need to find the children that they have. So we need to find these information. Now uh, we generally go with the first column as uh, like the family name, right? Sharma, Kanna, Reddy, Patel. But while solving any of those grid based puzzles, we must see that how is the data given to us. If you see, uh, it is more of code than family. Like, for example, if you see this, Jitesh belongs to family A, uh, Ritwik belongs to family C, right? Family B, we are given about something about family B, it is not a part of family B, etc. So, what we shall do is we will fill the first code as code A, B, C, D. Okay, then we can fit family and then we can have child one, first child and the second child and we can categorize as like what kind of category it is like uh, boy, 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 girl, uh, girl, girl, so three categories. Okay, so we know that there is a family which is boy, boy, there is a family which is, there are two families which have a boy and a girl. And there is a family which has both girls. All right, that is one information. Then another information that is given to us is that Patels have two boys. So this family is Patel. Okay, and uh, based on this information, we will fill in the names as well. So it says Jitesh, a boy belongs to family A. So J Jitesh belongs to family A. Now, if Jitesh is present, so it has at least one boy. So either it will be either boy boy or it will be boy girl okay so we'll just put b as of now and put a blank then uh, it says family b and sharmas have at least one girl that means family b is different and sharmas is a different thing so whenever you use and that means these are two separate entities so family b at least has a girl okay <coughs> Kavya, a girl, does not belong to Khannas, so we will come to it later, the negative statement. Ritwik, a boy, belongs to family C. So this is Ritwik belonging to family C. So this has at least one boy. Uh, Prema, a girl, and Aman, a boy, do not belong to the same family. So Prema and Aman belong to different families. Vishal, a boy, does not have a sister. So Vishal is that boy-boy family, that is Patel. So, one of the persons here is Vishal. Nidhi, a girl, belongs to one of the given families. So, one girl name is Nidhi. Sana, a girl, does not belong to the Reddies and belongs to the same family as Kavya. So, Sana and Kavya, these are two sisters. Okay. Now, let us find out the what is the family they can be. Right. So, we have four families. One is uh, Reddy. Then we have Sharma, Patel and Khanna. Okay. So Reddy are both boys. That is given to us. Sorry, Patel is both boys. And they, uh, this says that uh, Nidhi and, uh, sorry, Sana does not belong to Reddy. So they are not Reddies. So Reddy will be boy-girl family. Okay. Similarly, Kavya does not belong to Khannas, right? So here it says Sana does not belong to Reddy, Kavya does not belong to Khanna. So Khanna will also be boy girl family. So that means these two belong to the girl girl family that is Sharmas. Okay. Now uh, it says that Reddies are not disguised as B. Ritwik does not belong to Patels. Okay. So this is not Patels, right? Uh, now we are given that. Uh, we are given that family B and Sharmas have at least one girl. So we know that Sharmas have both girls. Now family B is not Sharma. So this means 
that this cannot be sharma so sharma is girl girl so the only possibility is this family is sharma and it has both girls which are sana and kavya okay now we have to find patel family and uh, like one of them will be patel family out of these three and uh, then we are also given that ritvik does not belong to patel right so if ritvik is not patel so patel has both boys this cannot be patel so patel has to be like family a is going to be patel and vishal is that son so vishal and uh, jitesh are two patels okay now we have left with two families one is uh, patel and sharma and we are left with uh, khanna and reddy it says that reddies are not disguised as b so this is reddy and this family is khanna family okay now we need to fill three people's name in this grid now those three people are uh one we see that prema and aman okay they belong to different families now this is uh this person is ritvik so we cannot have a boy here it has to be a girl so aman automatically goes to this family so this is a boy boy family this is a girl boy and boy girl families now aman is a boy so aman cannot belong to this family so aman belongs to this family and prema uh, prema belongs to this family now there is one person left which is uh nidhi is one of the girls that belongs to one of the families so this is nidhi so this completes our arrangement of the four families their code and the two children of these families which family does prema belong to so prema belongs to reddy family nidhi's sibling is aman which family is disguised as d that is sharma the pair that has two children belonging to the same family aman vishal no uh, ritvik nidhi no they are not siblings jitesh and vishal are siblings so that is the solution to the set and the answers to the questions